The Amana Creative Hub stands as a pivotal platform dedicated to empowering the youth of Aceh, underscoring the government's commitment to engaging the younger demographic. This initiative aims to nurture and showcase local talent. In a recent speech, the significance of innovation and creativity was highlighted as essential for the future of Aceh's youth, aligning seamlessly with national development objectives. This emphasis serves to inspire local entrepreneurs to pursue their aspirations. President Joko Widodo has received commendation for maintaining a high approval rating, alongside promoting balanced development across Indonesia. His efforts signify a departure from Java-centric policies, showcasing a commitment to inclusivity for all regions. The establishment of creative hubs throughout Indonesia is indicative of the government's aim to cultivate innovation among the youth. This initiative represents a broader strategy designed to empower young minds and foster their creative potential. President Widodo's vision encompasses equitable development from Sabang to Morocco, ensuring that every region shares in the benefits of national progress. This approach is intended to bridge the developmental disparities evident across various areas. However, the challenges faced in implementing development projects under President Widodo's leadership reflect a sense of urgency and the high expectations placed on local leaders. The emphasis on rapid execution is crucial to fulfilling the president's ambitious goals. Collaboration among local leaders, including governors and regents, is vital for the success of development projects in Aceh. Their active participation not only enhances community engagement but also optimizes the allocation of resources. The Amana Creative Hub in Aceh is particularly noted for producing competitive products, such as high-quality patchouli, sought after by global perfume brands. This achievement exemplifies the region's distinct agricultural strengths. Revitalizing local coffee and rice supply chains illustrates dedicated efforts to satisfy regional demands while minimizing imports from neighboring provinces. Such initiatives significantly contribute to food security and bolster the local economy. In alignment with sustainability objectives, the establishment of electric vehicles and repair shops aims to improve local transportation solutions. This strategic move reflects adherence to regulatory requirements while fostering green practices. The implementation of smart agriculture practices enhances fertilization precision and boosts crop yields. This technological advancement not only promotes productivity but also supports local food security initiatives. Innovative young minds in Aceh are developing fertilizer-spreading drones and advanced robotic technologies. This initiative not only empowers the youth but also significantly accelerates technological progress within the agricultural sector. The Amana program serves as a beacon of hope and progress for the youth of Aceh, illustrating their achievements and the potential for future advancements. It marks a significant milestone towards regional development and empowerment. Moreover, the collaboration between the government and youth in Aceh underscores the critical role of community involvement in achieving sustainable prosperity. It encourages active participation in initiatives that benefit the local populace. Finally, the celebration of Ace Nee's youth successes highlights the profound impact of mentorship and guidance from leaders such as President Jokowi. Their engagement is pivotal in nurturing and preparing the next generation for future challenges.